Roblox Stores is scary, so I'm adding it to Minecraft to try and make it less scary. First we'll add Seek, and I decided to make Seek out of the Warden. After adding a few details, this is what he looked like in Minecraft. He can even emerge from the ground just like he does in the real game, so that's pretty cool, but it's still kinda scary. Next I'm going to make Figure, and I used an Enderman even though I probably should have used the Warden. Anyways, after adding the bones on his chest, I was pretty much done, and Figure ended up looking a lot less scary in Minecraft. That is, until you go to the end. Next I will make Screech, and I decided a guardian would be the best fit for him. There isn't really much to say about this one other than the fact that he bounces around everywhere and it looks really funny, but even if it's funny, it still can be scary. Next we will make Ambush, and I decided to make him from a ghast. After reshaping the ghast and adding some green detail, this is how Ambush looked in game. He looks so ominous. Next I'm going to make Glitch, and Glitch was one of the harder mobs to make, but luckily I was still able to add him to the game, and as you can see, absolutely nothing went wrong. Okay, his name is Glitch, I meant to do that. Next I made Rush, and I decided to use a bee to make him. This was basically just a test of my drawing skills, and it's safe to say I'm a professional. Okay, well, it doesn't look that bad, honestly. Next, I made Jack from a skeleton. At first, he looked cursed, but I fixed him up a little bit, and this is how he turned out. He still looks cursed, but he's cursed in 32x now. Alright, looks aside, at least he can fight. Nope, they're just fighting each other. Next, I made Eyes, and I used a bee again because it's from a different video. This one definitely didn't belong in Minecraft. It looked so Bruh. weird. It literally looked like an army of security drones were chasing me. Next, I'm going to make Holt, and I used an Allay to make him. This was probably my best Doors entity I'd made yet, but when I added him to the game, for some reason, he still had two arms and wings. Eventually, I fixed it, and now I had Holt to be my sleep forever. I mean, look, guys, he brings me diamonds. Cool. Next, I made Timothy. Okay, I didn't actually make Timothy, I just colored a spider. But I know Timothy is really annoying, so I made it so whenever I open a chest, Timothy spawns. I'm just kidding, he was already there. I don't feel like coding that. Next, I made Hyde, and I know Hyde isn't really an entity, so instead I made a closet and the little eye is him. I even put black wool inside the closet and used water to kick myself out to make it more real. Next, I made Shadow, and this was the hardest mob to make. It took me one single click. He also was not very cool in game, so we'll just pretend this never Bruh. happened. Next, I made Window, and instead of making a mob, I just drew window on glass. So now every single piece of glass I place has window on it. That's it. Subscribe to see me make more custom mobs.